I'm so happy. It was very impressive. <laughs> All these people in the... No, no, it was... It, we are so happy. So happy of, uh, to receive this award, of course. And we were just surprised because we didn't know that it was the first one. So. <laughs> Very quick. So, yeah. But we are so happy because it was a huge work during the pandemic time. And also, uh, it's, it's, it's so cool to share this with Arthur. And, uh, yeah. yeah. We are so moved now. This one is good, so you can put, put like that. Yeah. And and people could... could, uh, could uh, For us, it's so refreshing, the special effects of that. It's it's really good. Good. Yeah. Uh, it's just <laughs> yeah, it's yeah. It's, this is what you this is what you do it for. This is what you're in the industry for. So, um, just to get an opportunity to work on something like this is just uh, phenomenal. It's really it's like a dream come true. So special is this to come to them and win the Chris um, it's such a pleasure, and what I didn't get to say on the stage, because I have terrible stage fright, is that him and Emma are just the most wonderful, kind people. I like enjoy showing up to work every day, which is not always the case, and um, they're funny and sweet and just down to earth, and, aside from being brilliant and masterful and making amazing films. But. Yeah, you know, and they, and they create like a super creative environment for all the people that work on their films, so uh, like I got to say on the stage, I mean, they unlock the best in you so you always feel the best best version of yourself uh, working with them it feels like i'm dreaming and it's my, this is my first bafta so it's the first time i'm here and getting this honor is it's, it's huge so I'm very very happy Oh, it's, it's fabulous. I mean, we're like a family now traveling around and, you know, everyone is also works so closely with each other. That's what's so special with Chris Nolan, that he invites everyone to the table. It is a huge honor. We are humbled and we are happy that our work was recognized, but more we are feeling that we need to keep talking about what is happening now in Ukraine and we are happy for this opportunity. War cities get occupied and destroyed and our work represents what is happening to Ukraine now. This win for this team reinforces the power of eyewitness journalism and now more than ever having brave colleagues go to the field and report from the world's hot spots is more important. Telling truth to power reporting faithfully events, that's what this win represents and that's amazing for the journalism that we all do every day. Tom, sounds important in every movie. Uh, <laughs> it was especially important in the zone of interest. Yeah. But how? Why? What could explain the role it plays in it? It's a great example of a sort of unusual circumstance where sound is really driving the narrative in an enormous way. And if you, if you shut your eyes, you're, you're watching a different movie, basically, with the pictures that get drawn in your head. So, yeah, I'm so thrilled that, you know, Jonathan thinks like that with his films and, and you know, an A24 kind of let us do that. And it's a leap of faith because the film didn't work until sort of, you know, a few months after shooting, met, you know, met, joining the, the horoscope onto the, the sort of family drama. So, yeah. It's so, it's help me out. It's Bath so, the Winning Worthy, come on. Well, we kind of made two films, didn't we, Johnny? I, I made a film that we see, which was like a, a family drama, and then Johnny created the terror that we hear, and when they're put together, I mean, you've got something quite special. He did film one, I did film two. Exactly. And All Not Alone, when they go on streaming. Yeah, exactly, yeah. I think that's the... I mean, it's a 